Hey everybody, it's Emily from Plaid, and today I'm super excited to share with you how to make a summer with Apple Barrel and Mod Podge. Today we're gonna to be doing this really fun tic-tac-toe board and scoreboard. You can make this with supplies found at your vacation on the beach or at home. So let's get started. Okay, so now we're gonna talk about some of the supplies that we need for this project. First, you can grab one of these really great wicker baskets. I bought mine at Walmart, but you can also thrift one of these too. So next, we're gonna be using this really great chalkboard surface. You can get this at Walmart too. It's a plaid product, and then that's gonna be how we keep all of our scores for who's winning on tic-tac-toe. Next, I'm gonna be using various supplies from the Promo ABWR22 kit. There's a lot of really fun colors, and it comes with a 10-piece uh, brush set in the kit as well. Some of the colors that we're gonna be using are gonna be Atlantis. This is a multi-surface satin paint. It's really great for a variety of surfaces. We also are gonna have a lemon and electric blue, white and princess pink, outrageous orange, and then finally today we're gonna be using a Mod Podge gloss. So this kit also comes with these four wood rounds. For this, I'm also gonna be using some wrapped up yarn. We have some stencils and stencil tape. And then finally, I got some sand and some seashells. So for the first piece, we're gonna be using these shells to be able to make really fun little X's and O's. Okay, so now that we've made these really fun tic-tac-toe pieces using a seashell and an ombre painting effect, we're gonna create sand to embed this onto our pieces. And to do that, we're gonna use Mod Podge, popsicle sticks, a bowl, and some sand. So now that we did our ombre into this wicker basket, we're gonna add our hash mark, and that's gonna be created with rope. Now we're gonna move on to creating our scoreboard. And for that, we're gonna use one of these really fun chalkboards from Plaid. Once we're done here, we're gonna add a little bit of detail at the top. For more project ideas and inspiration, go to platonline.com.